An accurate count in the upcoming census means more money for cities. The city of Phoenix is working with two companies on a digital effort that will help reach areas that are typically undercounted. Cronkite News reporter Delaney White explains the iCount 2020 campaign. The city of Phoenix partnered with Cisco and Microsoft to create these mobile sign-up stations. I'll show you how they work. A key part of the iCount 2020 campaign is repurposed vehicles that contain digital technology from Microsoft and Cisco to help citizens participate in the census next year. So today we're launching our City of Phoenix uh, 2020 census campaign and we're highlighting our census outreach vehicles. And the key part with the vehicles is really allowing us an innovative approach to be able to be out in the community, interact with them face to face, as well as be able to bring education and awareness about the importance of the census. Phoenix Mayor Kate Gallego spoke about the digital divide and what her city is doing to fix the problem. We know that there's been exciting connections with the digital world, but there's still a digital divide. Not everyone has access or is comfortable using the internet. The city is working to minimize this divide. We're exploring all the options we have to put city resources to work, to provide internet access to those who need it. The vehicles will also contain technology to assist citizens with accessing information about the census. We actually have tablets inside there which give you direct access to our local regional census website, which is a hub that has all kinds of important information about the census. Why is it important? What are the impacts? Questions about privacy. How is your information being used? So we have all of that information available on the tablets. The vehicles will travel to different neighborhoods in the coming months, but the schedule is still being worked out. In Phoenix, Delaney White, Cronkite News.